What's up gamers? We are back once again with another Gamerswagger.com Let's Play. This time around, we are playing Call of Duty Zombies. Now, something unique about Call of Duty Zombies is the fact that we have Nuketown 2025. And as you can see right there, I just upgraded the Matar or the Mater um, in the pack approach. Now, what I found really unique about Call of Duty Zombies this time around is the fact that you can actually upgrade your weapons multiple times. And each time you upgrade them, you get a different result. In this video, you'll see that uh, I'll upgrade the Mater more than once. I'll just wait for this other player to finish pack of punching the game. And I'm, as you can see, I'm going to upgrade this Matar for the second time. Now pay careful attention to the scope that I receive once I have now pay attention to the scope that I have attached to the malevolent toxonomic iodized redeemer as it's called now or mater for short once I've upgraded it for the second time. <laughs> Here I am trying to upgrade the RPD for a second time, but you know, unfortunately that weapon you can only upgrade, you can only pack a punch one time. But with the, the Mater, the second upgrade actually, you know, gives me a target finder and highlights uh, enemy adversaries on the playing field with a red diamond. Now, of course, you can find this weapon. This weapon is unlocked in Call of Duty's multiplayer, but I thought it was really cool to actually have that type of scope added to one of the weapons in Call of Duty Zombies, you know, once you pack a punch it the second time. Now, the second time you actually pack a punch a weapon, you get an additional scope, which definitely helps when you're trying to target, you know, the zombies. Now I'm just going to let you guys enjoy some really intense zombie, zombie gameplay. You know, because it we're in, I think, round 
16 and 17 right now, and it is hectic. We're using every weapon at our disposal, and you know, the zombie hordes just keep coming. One of my comrades went down. I gotta make sure every time one of my comrades go down, I'm throwing monkeys. You know, just just to be a, a good team player. I got stuck on a rock right there. And that sucked because I was trying to get away from those zombies. It was so close to level 20. I need a, a ammo opponent so bad right now. That ends up being it. We lasted 17 rounds. I personally had 198 kills. 189. And that's about it. I'll definitely be having more Nazi Zombie Let's Plays. Um, check back on GamerSwagger.com pretty regularly. I'll be putting them out. Uh, more and more.